so uh, getting into the clearing finale. So finally, it is. Ha- it has been a while since uh, we've actually talked about it. Mm-hmm. Um, so the last time that we we kind of had a chat, it was Freya's son that got taken, and yeah. then you thought it was Henrik. Um, and the way that the episode kind of plays out is that Matreya, who was like the head of the um, the the church, mm. you think that she took him. But then it wasn't her. And yeah, in that moment, the cops also swarm because she's she's um she was bullshitting the whole time about her dementia. <laughs> and in like the chopper comes down and blows her wig off. It was like, Jesus. like that, that was the big unmasking like Scooby Doo and shit. <laughs> 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 but it turns out that Freya's daughter, Max, had taken um, her son. Uh... Sort of, so, so that the um, the church couldn't take him, the cult couldn't take him. Wow. Yeah, which is pretty cool because at the end, it's almost like the clearing was getting rid of your baggage so that you can come together as a family unit, as yeah. a real family unit. Uh, which is kind of cool to see. The thing that that was sort of left hanging there was what the fuck happened afterwards. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, they find they finally catch this chick, and then nothing. There isn't even like the the little notes over the epilogue. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, you know, yeah. usually there's like Johnny went on to law school. AJ <laughs> was still dancing in the hood for dollars. <laughs> like, yeah. We, um, it's funny you mentioned that we just finished watching Wind River because B's never seen it before. Oh, and yeah, it nice. comes up with that at the end. And it still fucking breaks my heart every time I read it, where they talk about how there's no statistics for um, Native American women being missing. Yeah. yeah that's wild shit. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, they didn't even have one of those. Wow. That sort of, that sort of wraps it up. Yeah. I wish they, I wish they did. Cause I think that there was, there was kind of a lot that would have had to have happened with, um, Guy Pierce's doctor that was helping Matreya, Matreya herself, what happened to the church and everything. And just, yeah. Yeah. And, and also Freya. Yeah. hundred percent. Yeah. Unless they're doing like a sequel series or something like that. <laughs> I don't know. The clearing part two. It's funny when you were talking about, like, you know, coming together as a unit. I just thought of fucking uh, Festivus (laughs) from the airing of grievances. (laughs) That's a real thing. There is, I think it's in Peru, I think, some South American um, country, but there's one day a year where all your shit just bubbles up and you're allowed to walk into a circle of O's and just start fighting. (laughs) Just fighting. Like, for real, there's, like, grandkids taking on, like, grandparents and God parents damn. and shit like that. Cousins <laughs> and everyone getting in there. There's a wild, like, wild fight. Yeah. <laughs> fucking crazy. Um, I'll get into uh, the flea bag as well. Okay. So, flea bag, this is the uh, Phoebe Waller-Bridge one. Mm-hmm. It was actually really, really good. So something very different from the show where the show has an actual storyline uh, <laughs> and she breaks the fourth wall. This was all her breaking the fourth wall. So it comes out more like a stand-up comedy. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. 